skill number 11. Give modified bed bath. Face and one arm, hand and under arm. Supplies needed, two pair of gloves, new gown, large towel for barrier, large towel for drying, four washcloths, basin, and soap. Critical element steps. Begin with eyes, wash eyes with wet washcloth, no soap. Using a different area of the washcloth for each stroke. Wash inner aspect to outer aspect, then proceed to wash face. Wash my hands, gather my supplies. Knock, knock, enter. Hello, my name is Anna, I'm a student CNA. May I please check your wristband? Hello, Miss Smith, I'm here to assist you to give you a bed bath. We're gonna wash your face and arm. May I please set my supplies on your table? Thank you. Get water. Make sure the temperature water is at a temperature that is in comfort level. Check with the client, make sure that it's comfortable for them. Would you like to check the temperature of the water? Is that all right? Yes. All right, we're gonna make sure that your curtain is closed for privacy and make sure your bed is locked for your safety before we start. I'm going to raise your height, uh, bed for a working height for me. your rail okay. before we start we're gonna remove your gown place your clean gloves on and remove the client's gown do not overexpose the body Put the gown inside a plastic bag at the foot of the bed or you could put it in your dirty linen hamper. Okay. I'm going to put a towel over your chest. Let's start with the face. Make sure there's a towel over on the client's face, uh, chest. Make sure your items are within reach. Make sure you show that you are using your soap. Wet your washcloth and make a mitten. Start with the eyes. We're gonna wash your eyes first, okay? I'm going to start with the furthest side from you first, from the inner to outer, using different side of the washcloth. Wash and rinse, no soap. Inner to outer, using different side of the washcloth. I'm going to dry your eyes. Pat dry, 
Now we're gonna wash your face. Would you like some soap on your face? Yes. Wash the face, starting from the forehead, the cheek, the nose, one side, furthest side from you, behind the ear, the chin, and come to the your side. From the forehead, cheek, nose, the chin, the, and go to the neck. Make sure you wash behind the neck. Now rinse using a different washcloth. Forehead, cheek, nose, behind the ear and the chin, same on your side. And get behind the neck as well. Now you will dry. Make sure you pat dry. The, all the areas you washed and rinse. Okay, now we're gonna move on to washing your arm. You're gonna remove the towel, place it under the arm, only exposing the arm. Be gentle with the joints. Do not overextend or flex the arm. You may dispose of the washcloths in the dirty linen hamper. And grab your second, uh, third and fourth washcloth for the arm. Put the wash basin under the hand. Make your mitten. Make sure the washcloth is wet. Get the soap. Start from the fingernails, gently, get between the fingers, the palm, make sure you're going all around the arm, gently, going up to the shoulder and underneath the arm. After you wash, you will rinse. Make sure your washcloth is wet. Start with the fingernails again and the fingers between the fingers, the palm, all around the arm, and be gentle with the joint shoulder, armpit. Once you finish rinsing, you're ready to dry. Move your wash basin and dry the arm with the towel. Make sure you get in between the fingers, all around the arm, pad drying, and under the arm, shoulder. Once you're finished, support the joint, raise the arm, remove the towel. You're ready to dispose your washcloth and towel in the dirty linen hamper or at the uh, plastic bag at the foot of the bed. Okay, remove your gloves. Do not contaminate yourself. Wash my hands. Now you're ready to put the new gown on. Do not overexpose the body. You could start with either arm. Okay, Miss Smith, put your arm through. Okay, and next arm. Tie the strings behind the neck. Now 
you could fix the blanket without overexposing the body. Make sure the gown is straight from underneath. Okay, Miss Smith, we're all done. I'm gonna lower your bed to a safe height and raise the rail up. Here's your call light. Would you like me to open your curtain? Yes. Okay. We'll open your curtain and make sure your bed is still locked for safety. Here's your overhead table with your supplies. Now you're ready to put on your second set of gloves in order to put your soap back in and put it in its designated area could drain the water in the uh, sink, rinse it out and dry it up and put it in its designated area. And you could dispose your towel in the dirty linen hamper or in the uh, plastic bag at the foot of the bed, which you will pick up in, uh, as you leave the room. Remove your gloves without contaminating yourself. and wash my hands and report and record.